بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله وسلم على نبينا محمد وعلى اله وصحبه وسلم اما بعد it's an obligation for us to teach and learn tawhid learn about the oneness of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala that he's the lord and creator of the heavens and earth that he's the only one worthy of worship and that he has divine names and attributes that we supplicate to him and we worship him with and in relation to that our brother jazallah khairan abbas abu yahya hafizallah ta'ala has compiled compiled some very uh very beneficial and concise verses from kitab ilah and told jihad from the ulama in regards to this allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says فَعْلَمْ أَنَّهُ لَا إِلَى إِلَى اللَّهُ وَسَلْخِ لِذَنْبِكْ لِلْمُؤْمِنِينَ وَلِلْمُؤْمِنِينَ وَالْمُؤْمِنَاتِ Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says فِي كِتَابِهِ الْكَرِيمِ So know that لَا إِلَى إِلَى اللَّهُ There has, there is no one worthy, no one has a right to be worshipped except Allah. And ask for forgiveness for your sins and also for the believing men and believing women. Ibrahim At-Taymi rahimahullah ta'ala said who died 72 Hijri that they meaning the companions of the Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam radiyallahu ta'ala anhum ajma'in used to recommend that a young child should learn what is said in the salah and the first arabic words that he says are la ilaha illallah meaning there is no god worthy of worship except Allah seven times so that would be the first thing that he would have spoken and this is collected by Abdul Razak and Ibn Abi Shaiba from Jafar from his father who said Ali Ibn al Hussein used to teach his son saying say I have believed in Allah and disbelieved in Taghut meaning the false deities Amantu billahi wa kafartu bi taghut and this was also collected in Ibn Abi Shaiba by Ibn Abi Shaiba Shaykh al-Albani hafiz uh, rahimahullah ta'ala muhaddith Allah yarhamuhu and may Allah bless all of the salaf of this ummah with jannat of ardos and those who came after them and those from this time like Imam Al Albani, wa Ibn Uthaymin, wa Ibn Baz, wa Sheikh Muqbil bin Hadi Al Wadi, wa wa Ghayrihim Kathir. Rahimum Allah Jamian. Sheikh Al Albani said, So, say, uh, so, O you Muslim, it is obligatory upon you, an individual obligation, that you hasten to know and acquaint yourself with the pure Tawheed, and what nullifies it. From shirk that is done by studying the book of Allah and the Sunnah of the Messenger sallallahu alayhi wasallam indeed whoever adheres to them will be successful and whoever deviates away from it becomes misguided Allah's help is sought wallahu musta'an and we ask Allah the Almighty to accept our good and forgive our evil and bless us to be of those who spread Tawheed and be of those who whose children Call to Kitab Allah wa Sunnah of Rasul sallallahu alaihi wasallam wa sallallahu alaihi wasallam ala Nabiya Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam.